The former president of France, Nicolas Sarkozy, is found guilty of illegally funding his 2012 re-election bid. Sarkozy was accused of overspending during his campaign. It was a verdict handed down by a Paris court of appeal. Sarkozy received a one-year sentence, of which six months were suspended. This means the suspended period could potentially be served using an electronic tag instead of imprisonment. The case is also known as the by Gamalian affair. Sarkozy allegedly overspent on his campaign and hired a PR firm by Gamalian to cover it up. Wednesday, the previously guilty verdict from a lower court. While the prosecutors couldn't prove Sarkozy's direct involvement, they argued he must have been aware of the scheme. What I keep from this is that the Court of Appeals confirms that it's about fraudulent organizations and overspending of campaign funds. What was said in the past was that it was not about Bagmalian, but about that so-called campaign funds of the candidate Nicolas Sarkozy. This was confirmed by the Paris Court and today again confirmed by the Court of Appeals. However, Sarkozy's lawyer said they will appeal the new sentence at France's highest court, putting any immediate prison term on hold. And this isn't the first legal challenge for the former president. In 2023, he received a suspended sentence for attempting to bribe a judge in 2014. Known for tough anti-immigration policies during his presidency, Sarkozy is the for first former French president to face a custodial sentence. The legal saga continues for the 68-year-old politician. He will be tried next year for allegations of taking illegal funds from the late Libyan dictator Muammar Gaddafi. That was during his 2007 presidential campaign.